Hello, collective. Oh, uh, I'm gonna be over here for a minute. My bad. But hello, y'all. Welcome in to another reading. I hope you all have been doing very well. Um, what the fuck is going on? Whatever is going on, I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. This should not happen. I'm trying to light my Palo Santo. And it's literally not even letting me light it. So someone does not want this message to be coming out. At all. Um, which is unfortunate. Um, but we're going to get it out anyway. Is, hold on, give me a second. Okay, we finally got it lit. It was being, this is weird. I've never had this happen before, but someone's really trying to not, someone's trying to prevent a message from getting to you. Someone's definitely trying to block up your energy field, I'm feeling. Ain't no way that should happen. Um, let's clean this area up a lot. Cleanse you all too. Get you all in it. Hell yeah. So let us find out what is going on in the energetic sphere of this realm that we call Earth. Um, I do, I keep getting called to say that closure. While I was in the shower, a song called Closure was playing, and um, it very much surprised me because this song never fucking plays whenever I have it on shuffle um and I, I keep my music on shuffle a lot sometimes you know and it never plays unless I choose it and today out of all the days it chooses to play closure something may be re-entering your life to end um it's like like a false hope almost. I don't know why false. That's funny. So someone has like a false hope of being able to revive something that is already dead. And I guess this is just like what is happening. Why that's hard to get this message out. Someone doesn't want you to know that their motives behind their actions are to try and spark up some sort of old energy necromancy revenant energy along with that i'm not gonna have to use this deck i haven't used, I used this one in a minute but i feel like it could pick up on the energy uh the best that we're gonna get into before we jump into the tarot or anything so what's going on here spirit what in this deck could be a valuable information also sorry if you can hear the uh music uh not the meditation music other things um roommates having a party or something i don't know uh we have the moon and moon water and will and then water comes out yeah so someone is definitely trying to water emotion strike up some sort of old emotion what moon is hold on give me another give me another second so i'm back and i'm sorry y'all uh i usually keep you guys update updated with the moon cycles and i forgot uh on the 8th new moon um today is the first day second night of the new moon um so i may have got the moon water uh especially because the eclipse um you know how they are <sighs> call them the dude call them the fucking the moon magic psychos or something honey Sleep magic unknown, June and immortality. <laughs> so, I'm really picking up that it's not fair. Someone's scared of you. Um, very scared. It's like, okay. So, someone's trying to talk to you in your sleep. Um, they may have some sort of gin on them, and they don't know how to get rid of it for some of you all. Others, it's someone trying to bring back a, a gin that they had. 
around you at one time, using familiars as well. Um, something about immortality. Someone just wants, like, your immortality. It's something about, um, why are you flushing, child? Hold on. Oh, what the fuck? There we go. I didn't realize I was flashing the whole time. My bad. Um, this should be better. But, um, it's like, someone's trying to, someone doesn't know how to put a gin on you. Someone might be trying to do this in your sleep state. Um, it's not gonna work. Someone's just out of it. Um, you are protected heavily, and this is the sigil for sleep, uh, for sleep protection if you want it. Yeah, I had to squint to see it, but I think y'all can see it just fine. I'm just blind. I'm just blind. Is there anything else, spirit? Yeah, the Apollo Santo is kicking up really heavy, too. Yeah, and with ne necromancy, astral projection into spring. Yeah, um, someone very much wants back into your energy. Um, trying to bring back old energies to <clears throat> go to you. Someone's doing a lot of astral projection. A lot of things just in your sleep state, they feel like that's the best way to talk to you. Um, but it's even like in your dream state, you're not caring about this person. So are you just going to keep this? Oh, so that's dead. Okay, cool. So probably no mic because um, my mic is dead. So sorry about that again. Uh, I can't do much about that. Um, I charge them and they just die quickly. It's just how it be. Um, if you can't hear me listen on a different device, sorry. Can't do much about it, okay? Moving on. Someone is bound to something that they are trying to put on, bound to this chaos and the illusion that they've tried to put onto you. And they almost, it's like, it's like, here, I don't want this gift even though I gave it to you. Uh, it's, it's so, it's, it's, someone gave you something. And you gave it back to them because you were like, I'm good. This person is trying to come back around and be like, no, 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 I think you should have it. Um, I don't I don't need it at all. Like, you, I, th I gave it to you. I gave it to you. Like, they want to give it back to you. Some sort of curse. Some sort of entity. But it's theirs. Um, it cannot be yours. Um, that reminds me. I don't remember all the signs that were representing these two little girls, but it was this one girl. I know her signs were like Capricorn, Sagittarius, Leo, Virgo. Um, and then there was another girl with like Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Uh, uh, oh God. Aries, I think, was on there too. The Scorpio, I think. But they were like, what the girls like, you have to say, please, can I have the red marker? And the other girl was like, can I have the red marker? And the the, one, the other girl goes, you have to say, please. <laughs> and the, the first girl goes, please, can I have the red marker? And the little girl looks at her and goes, no, you may not. And she turns, the other one turns around and just scream cries mom. That's the energy of what's happening. Someone's trying to come back into your energy, and it's like, I have to ask Collective for help. I have to ask Collective to do something. And Spirit Team has been like, you have to go. You have to do it. And you're going to decline this person, I feel. You might decline this person, or this person has a fear of you declining them. And it's like, if you do, they're just going to fucking go ballistic. And that's the energy that's coming through. Um, or, yeah, but that's just how things have to play out with order and new moon. <laughs> This new moon is bringing a lot of order into things. Water and cauldron, a lot of, uh... Mm. Yeah, oh. Someone's bound to something that they did in the wintertime as well. Is what I just picked up with that, too. Um, so... These people, if this person's been doing work on you since wintertime, they're bound to everything that they did on wintertime to now. Can't do much about that. Sucks to be you what do you want um this song cooler than me is playing you wear designer shades to hide your face and you wear them around like you're cooler than me you never say hey or remember my name it's probably because you think you're cooler than me that's the energy this person feels like you're in because of your glow up 
um, this person is seeing you glow up and it's like, oh, so you're just going to leave me behind? You think you're cooler than me now or something? Yes. If you're going to project it out, yeah, I'll take that projection because that looks good on me. It's the energy that I feel. Um, but someone wants to almost play like, oh, you are you think you're cooler than me. So that make so now like, like, I don't know, someone's like, I don't want to even get into their mentality, their weird fucking conundrum game. Uh, someone's just trying to play back on old emotions where like, oh, you're a sweetheart. So like, if I'm in danger, you'll help me because you forgive me. So that means you have to come back and like open your arms up and like give me kisses and, and, and help me. I don't know. It's weird because it's like this person, no, I don't know, this person really wants to plan the fact that like you know that no one should have to go through that horrible shit, but this is also a lesson for this person to learn um, because they refuse to learn it the easy way, so now God's giving them tough love and they don't like the tough love, so they're going to come to you to get the soft, easy, oh, angel love, but I feel like you're also going to give this person tough love and that's just going to send them off rockers because they feel like God's conspiring against them when that's not the case. Um, they just need to buckle down and get ready to be humiliated um, and just kind of fall down that rabbit hole of like you get what you get. Um, I mean, I don't know. There's not really much else to say. Someone's just really like they don't want to give up but by them not giving up they're just making it extremely harder um on themselves you're not even involved this isn't even between you this is a battle between someone and their ego but they're trying to project it onto you and make you feel like it's the issue because this person can't stop thinking about you um but it's just like this could be between two people that like you but also like they like you and they have the mutual agreement of destroying you because you don't want either of them as well which is weird um but at the same time it's not bringing anyone closer to you it's act it's like i don't know man it's like they're playing tug of war with each other but no one it's like i don't know it's so fucking weird it's it's just fucking i want to squish it out because that's dumb as fuck I mean I touched you yeah I haven't used you in a minute I haven't used you in a minute but let's see um what's going on here I'm gonna try something here I'm gonna try it cause like I know y'all have a hard time hearing me and I don't want that to be like a reoccurring theme even though I can't necessarily hear it at the moment so I'm going to do one of these. I don't know if this is going to work. It's not going to work at all. Hold on. I don't know how to fucking do this. It doesn't matter, but I also want it to be okay for you all. Uh, give me a second. Okay, so I hope this is better. I don't know. You just have to deal with it for a minute. I'm doing the best I can at the moment. Like It's... Technical difficulties left, right, and center. But we had the Princess of Wands that came out. Ooh, yeah, so someone does not want this tower. They... <laughs> the Princess of Wands, the Tower Reverse, an adjustment in the upright. With the Princess of Disc Reverse, wow. So this is someone that does not have... That could be like a Leo, a Sag, an Aquarius, energy coming out, Virgo and as well. I said Sag, right? Sagittarius? I think I said Sag as well. But someone has a lot of displaced energy, and it's not your fault. This person is just like, they're blaming it inconveniences on you to like to justify the way they feel about you it's like oh um 
like, oh, I forgot to tie my shoes when I walked out the door this morning and I tripped over them. I'm going to blame Collective for that. It's, I don't know, someone, like, hmm. No, someone is, like, down bad because of you, Collective. I'm not even going to lie. No, yeah, but someone is, like, down bad because of you. Like, down down bad all they do is like they think about you and they think about you so much that like you are there <laughs> it's like you're this person's issue but they want to have you so that they can have some sort of control over their issue, which is you, but you're not their issue. It's so fucking bizarre. I'm comp. I'm. It's the Empress reverse. Yeah. There's just some like someone that doesn't work. They don't put hard effort into things. They're very deluded, convoluted, and the word delusional comes up when I'm holding it. But like someone's going trying to avoid their own downfall by continuously doing what they feel is right um which is lying and stealing and being a nuisance um no offense to y'all i'm just that's the energy i'm feeling though but someone it's like they're trying to hold that back though they're trying to hold back that they're doing it for a negative reason they want to they want to come towards you and suck their thumb while they talk to you. Oh, wow, confirmation with incense coming upon over here. But it's like they 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 can't come towards you because they're scared of you knowing what they're going to knowing like who they are. You're intuitive, you're most likely not from this planet. Welcome. How we do when y'all um and they're just terrified of you because like you're the one person that it's like, even if they tell you the truth or a lie, you don't necessarily care? And you're the one person that's supposed... Or they feel like you're the one person that's supposed to care about them. Yeah, with the Princess of Wands... The Prince of Wands and the Nine of Wands reverse. Leo, Sag, Energy. That's literally like... It is like... Someone has a lot of domination control issues, and yeah, it's all coming out. Someone, someone's been, someone's already been exposed for who they are. Then they just don't want. I don't know, man. It's like it's given. It's given the energy of like you're. You have road rage, um, because you're late to a doctor's appointment, right? And this car is in front of you and you end up throwing your water bottle at this dude's car because they're not driving when the light is green immediately. Turns out this dude is your doctor and he walks in and recognizes your face and you recognize his face and it's a whole like, oh shit, like I threw my water bottle at you. So meanwhile, while this doctor is helping you, you feel like this doctor is like talking shit about you or like, oh wow, like they know I'm an asshole because I did those things and I can't take those things back. And that's what's going through this person's mind. The Hermit reversed, the Princess of Cups reversed, the Four of Cups reversed, the High Priestess reversed, and the Knight of Wands reversed. Someone can't come towards you because they feel like a dumbass. They, they know what they've done. They know that there's no taking those things back because those actions already happened. Um, they know that you haven't forgot about them. They know that there is nothing that these that they can do to switch up your mind about how they took out these actions. Um, it's even giving that someone with the hermit reverse, someone may have lied about you heavily, 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 heavily behind your back. But this person's reaction will tell you that. The way this person will act will like someone's just like defamed you maybe a family has defamed you as well and they need you to go back for them or something and they can't they have to do it privately and secretly because they know that you know that they know what they did and they want to keep this mask on of oh you're still a bad person or you deserved it because xyz 
when in actuality you didn't deserve any of it and they're suffering they're act they're like they're getting like triple karma at this point someone needs your help that fucked you over and they can't ask you for that help and not only because it's even it's not even giving like if they give their ego up they still wouldn't be able to ask you because their emotions would be so high like oh fuck i did this i did that they have to go through the dark night of their soul and they don't want to do that especially by themselves so it's like how do i go to collective act like i'm healed um act like i actually am sorry how do i put on this performance they don't know and they don't have anyone around them to help them so it's almost like they're trying to ignore it but them ignoring it comes off as really just ignorant like I don't know yeah this person is, has no power they don't know what the fuck to do nothing they do is working this queen of cups reverse is not changing anything this prince of cups reverse there's this deck is this deck in reverse no because the two of swords is upright you get your peace someone's confused by your peaceful someone doesn't understand yeah the knight the prince of cups reverse and the three of wands yeah someone's fucked up buddy someone's fucked up some they don't understand it could be a virgo it could be an aquarius i'm hearing a libra as well Leo again. Someone doesn't know how the fuck they lost. Someone doesn't understand. Some it's like it's really given the energy of what the fuck. Because it's like I don't know, man. What the fuck? Like I don't even. I, it's like so mundane is the energy. It's like even if this if. if, if even if this person asks you for help, they know that you wouldn't really care that much. Though you're a good, loving person, and like you, most likely, you know, if someone really, truly needed help, you'd help them. But this person doesn't want to believe that, so they're being a scared about it. But if they do come to you, there's a feeling of arrogance, like, oh, you better help me. And that in itself will turn you away from helping this person. And they don't want to admit that. They want to think that they still have some sort of power. Yeah, for a Wanderverse, this person is suffering a lot of instability. But that is just to make things fair and balanced. These people wanted your life to be down in the shitter, down in the dumps. For them to get an upgrade by doing black magic and shit on you. Meanwhile, it goes back to you and goes, Oh, well now it's your turn. How are you going to handle this collective? And you just do your prayers your turn to cinders you know nothing bad maybe a cord cutting or a banishing and it's like oh so you're not gonna do anything to directly hurt someone you're just gonna do vague things to protect your energy it's like yeah i might i might target someone if i need them out of my energy for sure but i'm not gonna like hurt them and god goes okay cool so your life's gonna go up and y'all's lives are gonna go down that's two losses for one team and two wins for another um, it's how it's coming up. Eight of Cups, yeah, you've walked away from these people. Uh, you don't mess with lust. Someone has... Like, someone's not strong enough to come towards you. Yeah, Judgment Reverse. Because they don't want... They're bored. They don't... They just don't have judgment on their side. They can't move forward peacefully. And again, with we have Shin on this card. Uh, geez, I don't even know why. Like that is Shin though on the bottom. The, the the three people there. So that's no peace. Like bad judgment, no peace. Horus is Horus is not on their side. And y'all know Horus. He goes he goes underworld, and he goes light and dark. You know. So it's like a messenger. There's some sort of message on both realms saying that this person is not worthy of doing X, Y, and Z so they can't come to you and do X, Y, Z but they don't want that to happen this Queen of Cups reverse has been exposed for who they are um, and there's nothing anyone can do about it but they're trying to like 
act like everything's fine. I don't know. With the Ten of Discs, the Ten of Cups, the Ten of Discs, and the Queen of Discs all in reverse. This person's going through hell in a hand best. They're literally losing everything. They're losing love life. They're losing their stability. They've lost status. They've lost, like, their foundation. If this person had, like, a job or a business, that's gone. Um, and if it's not gone, it's decreased. Like, they no longer can have money. Money is, like, blocked for them. Happiness is blocked. Well, happiness was probably bought for this person beforehand, which is why they attacked you. But, like, now it's really blocked. Like, there's not... Like, this person has just, like, caved themselves in with cement. Yeah, and they're scared as fuck that you get to go on this new leap of faith. They're very unhappy with it. They're very jealous and envious of that because this person's not strong enough to do those things but they because they're codependent yeah they can't interfere with you either this queen of discs reverse yeah you don't give a fuck they want you to almost be hard like to be sad about their life falling to shit but you don't care and they feel like that's not who you are but it's at the same time that's not your fault so someone, it's like a weird, like, narcissistic victim mentality of, oh, I didn't get my way, so you have to feel bad for me because I'm not getting my way. No one has to feel sorry for you for not getting your way. But the Prince of Swords reverse and the Devil reverse, lol, and the Nine of Swords reverse, yeah. Someone has a self-fulfilling prophecy to do. A contract is completely over. There's, like, you're free. You're not bound by these people. There's nothing holding you from like to these people. God has cut that connection himself. Um, it's over. It's done. It's gonzo. Um, so that's why they feel like they want to just keep the connection though still, but they know that you have free will, and that's what's keeping them away. Is they're they're using like the remainder of their free will to avoid you to still slander and talk about you because they want to say that you wouldn't help them which in turn will make you not help them when if, if they were to ask due to that energy just floating around them um on mario kart when you got the fucking storm cloud and you had to bump into someone to give them that storm cloud to shrink them down that's what this person's doing that storm cloud's about to go off the lightning is already formed they just want to see if they can bump into you last second to switch off so you get hit with it instead. And I'm not feeling that it's going to work. Someone is just going to have to get struck down. <clears throat> but it's all, it's just giving like they don't want to go be the only one to go down either. So this person's attaching themselves to people who are on the same vibration as them. So it's a domino effect. Um, Just so they don't have to feel bad. Yeah, with the Four of Cups reverse, someone. Yeah, someone is having some very bad looking backs. Like, someone fucks up. Someone is fucked up from this. Like, emotionally fucked up from this. They can't believe that they messed this up. They can't believe that their life is this. It's really, I'm just hearing, like, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Like, you kind of have to, though. With the six, wow, that's so fucking weird, dude. Yeah, the six of cups reverse, the seven of cups reverse, the five of swords upright, the four of swords upright. Someone's having a lot of negative nostalgia. They they thought that. I don't so. Someone needs to just give it a rest, dude. Someone is living a, a facade life they're not they've never once been happy is what's coming up and this person has never really been happy maybe you made this person happy confirmation with my body but maybe you made this person happy they've never experienced true happiness or joy and they didn't know what you did to them but they thought it was witchcraft and it feels like someone agreed with that and ran with it just so that you wouldn't 
make this person happy. It's giving the energy of someone new that you could bring someone up, but they wanted to be brought up instead. So instead of asking for advice or for help, this person just told lies to you to the person that you were supposed to bring up and lift up the shit on their life and someone else's so that everything would be bad. And it's giving the energy of like, even if you were to tell this to someone, the person that brought this person down to shit level would continuously like lie and be like, oh yeah, sure, yeah, this, you know, they know what they're talking about, like yeah, 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 is the energy. Um, about that, this person's a demon. And let me tell you the truth. Let me tell you why this person's a demon. In the Catholic, in the Roman Catholics, when you do exorcism, when there is an entity, a demon around, they promise things of God. They promise miracles. They promise abund they promise the godlike things. But when it comes down to the time for those godlike things to happen, they do not come to fruition. That is sign of a demon. This person listen to a demon someone who was possessed by a demon doesn't matter if they want to believe in it or not this world is spiritual and if you want to stay blind to it you can stay blind to it but this person has a demon on them this liar has a demon on them the reason this one person's cards keep coming out in reverse is because they have a demon attached to them they keep lying to people about a promise of of gold of fortune Look at this with the five of swords. Look at that rainbow. It's like, yeah, we can, we'll totally have all this rainbow. All we had to do is sacrifice uh, these, like these people. But this person literally will hoard all of it for themselves. This person only wants to self suffice off of others. And this person sold someone a dream. Um, another sign of entity attachment of a demon. For y'all that know exorcisms, word. Um, I'm getting into exorcisms. Um, I want to start performing them as well here soon. I don't know when soon is, but here soon. Um, I have been getting a lot of downloads of that needing to happen, a lot of signs and synchronicities of that needing to happen. So it's on the thing. It's on my horizon um, for sure. But um, this person, it's, it's really, it's really weird. Because this person may also just have mental issues as well. But the, the energy of just like a demon. Because there's no reason why. This is lust. This is greed and gluttony. Major, major big boy demons. You know, the seven princes, if you will. This person has at least three of them <laughs> attached to them. Um, and they, they're not going anywhere. And you activated all three of them almost at once. When this person seen you. So they did what they did. They manipulated. Um, they can also. within When people are possessed. Uh, by these entities. They, they can have angelic premonitions. Um, because the devil will sometimes. Form and use the form of. An angel or a good hearted character. To swoon. And manipulate their way into. Uh, an, a vessel that is. A virgin status. Um, just not leaning towards any faith, just being neutral, um, or having their own conception of what they wish to believe of a, of a, you know, a virgin vessel. This is what this person did. They, they manipulated, they scammed, they full out fuck someone's life over, but they're almost in a sense coming back to finish that person off and see if they can get you in. Um, but this person sees this other person as like a demon. I don't know. It's probably some sort of weird attachment, some sort of cord that this person has because, you know, they've been around this entity for God knows how long. So of course there's like a, some sort of cord attachment that they can pull and string on and ring the bell to make them go like, oh, but yeah, you're right. I, you know. Yeah, I don't know. It's given weird energy, but it needs to be put to rest. Someone may be being put to rest. There may be a death occurring, happening. Actually, for some, I don't know if take it if that as it resonates. But other than that, some there is like a need to lay something to rest. Um, closure. You have felt closed a cycle out, but this part. So it's giving this. It's a one-sided attachment. 
that's what we're coming to, Spirit. Because you don't have any cords attached to these people anymore. You don't care. You are living your own life without these people's energy being around you. And you're not doing things in a way to piss them off or to agitate them. You're doing things because you thoroughly enjoy doing those things. You're not doing it in the sense to agitate someone. Um, but these people are trying to do those things to agitate you. Um, and it's weird. It's so it's giving like, I'm an asshole and I'm doing this to piss you off. So you must be doing that to piss me off too. No collective actually just enjoys doing what they do. They, they don't, they're not doing anything to bother you. And you can't bother collective. So this is like the whole. It's it's weird, but the devil don't play fair. Um, the devil will totally come in and um, make seem make things seem like they're okay and swell and and goody, um, but they're not. Um, the devil loves to see people miserable and the entities and the demons that these people have attached to them thrive off that misery. So of course their vessels are going to seem like they're having a fun time, but they're rotting corpses on the inside. Like you can't, you can't fool someone. You can't. So, so what's this? With the King of Wands reverse, yeah, someone's trying to do some manipulation tactics to seem a certain way. With the Nine of Cups reverse, yeah, they make you feel like you're missing out on something. Knight of Wands. But you, you yeah, what the fuck? With the Ace of Swords, yeah, so someone, someone's made it a conscious decision to continue going on with these lies, to live this weird facade life. Um, It's not going to last much longer, I can tell you that. Um, and it's like they know that too, but they don't want to listen to it. There's, they don't, uh, I can't hear you. I can't hear you energy. Like I'm having a fun time. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. It's how they're coming off. Yeah. With the three of swords reverse, they just like, you're, I don't know, man. Someone, someone like is like mocking you to seem like they're okay but you can tell that this person's like almost mocking you and it's weird yeah like yeah with the ace with the magician reverse someone does not have this spark someone has wasted talents so, oh god i didn't mean for it to come out like that baby but okay shit i mean shit come through yeah with the two of swords and judgment yeah someone cannot escape this judgment someone It's sad, bro. I call all my energy back, but it's sad. Yeah, with the world reverse, there's a cycle that these people have to complete uh, of conflict. Not a, not a one. Yeah. Now they're going to be, they're going to the test. They're being put to the ringer. Um... Yeah, Wheel of Fortune reverse. It doesn't look like it's going too well for him. <laughs> the Wheel in reverse. Things are not going too well for him. They're like their their heart chakra is fucked up. Their root chakra is out of whack. Their their solar plexus isn't good. Their crown chakra like someone's fucked up. They're emotionally disabled. Disabled. God. They're emotionally imbalanced, not disabled. Goodness, come through Aquarius, I guess. No, but they're emotionally unsta unstable. They are mentally unstable. They can't think. They don't have that connection to the divine. They're just walking around puppets at this point. Their say their solar plexus is fucked up. They don't have a life path anymore. They've strayed so far across away from it that now they can't even like. Their whole life is becoming a mirage, essentially. And with the root chakra, it's like... Someone just has no foundation at all. It's like they're losing, but they do things to make them seem like they're gaining, almost. Yeah, it's for strength. And the Ten of Pentacles reverse. 
<laughs> yeah. Someone... Someone needs to conserve their energy and not waste it because they are going to need to be strong here soon because this Ten of Pentacles is not in their favor. Um, they are losing everything. They know what they are, but they're just wasting their energy. And they know this for sure. With the sun upright, they know that you have an emperor in the coming in, and that's another thing that has been balanced. With the emperor upright, the ace of wands, the sun, if you've manifested something and it's highly protected, it's coming into you. This emperor could be a job offer, someone who's going to tell you like truth, a law officer, an actual emperor. But with the uh, hierophant, not the higher. This isn't the hierophant. That's a judgment. That's this is temperance. Godness gracious. Yeah, this is temperance. Temperance reverse with the seven of pentacles upright. Yeah, someone's in. Someone's fucked up, bro. Someone has too much on their plate. Yeah, and you have a leap to take with the knight of wands as well. You're, yeah, and, and justice. It's fair. It's your justice to move on. Like, you're not stuck in the past like these people. It's it's so it's so weird. With the three of swords reverse, someone is not moving forward. Yeah. This could be a Leo energy. Um, Aries. And the fucking Queen of Cups reverse. And the seven of wands, yeah. This heavy, heavy Leo, heavy, heavy, uh, sad. Like I'm picking up Leo, Sag, Aries, Virgo, Pisces energy, and then Libra energy with the Justice, and then Knight of Cups reverse. Yeah, someone like, if someone's trying to. Damn. So yeah, this per. Oh my God! Wow. So, this person, its give, this is how it's coming. This person wanted you to be alone and to never have anyone near you, right? This person's punishment is they have to keep going back to the same person over and over again. But this person makes them feel alone. So, they don't have the gratification of, oh, haha, I have someone they feel even worse knowing that this is the only person they can go to because they both have a mutual agreement of devastation on their hands and so they just trade that energy of being in a horrible mood together <laughs> i don't know it's like y'all remember the robins in from fucking gumball how they hated each other but then they would go get like oh innuendo we're gonna go have like a make out session or something you know how they are how the robinsons were but this like they hate each other but like oh you're the only thing that i can fuck so i might as well it's it's really gross i don't know i don't know someone just like they're almost like they're so self-sabotage they it's so like it's kind of funny it really is at this point it's really funny how self-sabotaging this person is death yeah something's coming to a complete over someone yeah someone is someone's being rejected it's over 79 and 60 that's crazy yeah someone may be getting harmed here soon someone knows that they're being rejected Something inevitable is going to happen to someone. And it's like giving... God, it's like the Final Destination energy again is coming back. Like someone gets readings on you and it's like, no, I don't believe that's going to happen to Collective. I don't believe that Collective is going to be happy. I don't believe that at all. And then I t they, they get a reading on you in the about blessings. On how you're a professional. Someone doesn't like that you're a professional. Someone has to Someone's pissed off that they have to apologize for doing these rituals on you. <laughs> this bully. Oh my god. And they're scared of you. Because <laughs> they know. 
they they're scared of this interaction dude so so someone's just a bitch okay let's leave it like that someone is someone's a bitch ain't cuz because it's like I'm scared of collective I can't go to them and tell in like I did all these things to them what if they do something to me you should be more worried about God baby collective might just call you a fucking idiot to your face and laugh at you Mo some of us will like you know what like there's different parts of us some of us will straight up be that you know laugh at them like you're a fucking dumbass and then the rest some of us will just stare at this person like really confused some of us might call the cops on this person it's like I they don't want I, I just want to be able to I don't want to you know what I don't want to do anything well good news baby um that's good news good news is that someone's true colors are has, they're fully exposed everyone knows this person's a bitch everyone knows that this person's scared of you Everyone knows that this person couldn't do anything to you if they tried. Um, they're just trying to puff their chest out until you're out of their energy so they can break down and cry. And that's what I'm picking up heavily. Yeah, withdraw. They can't do anything. They feel rejected. They're being they feel like a reject, I feel. They like they're just they need to quit. They're awakened though. Someone's going through some sort of awakening, truly. What's this awakening about? Oh, that they took breath. <laughs> oh my god. They're coming to their they're awakening to um that they're they're awakening to that their ego let them take a bunch of bribes. Um Yeah. And now, like, someone's, like, awakened to that. Their whole, the only reason why their life is fucked up is because of them. This is literally how there it is. We have care here. Like, someone's parents may have set someone up to doing something. Someone's mom or dad may have been like, Oh, do whatever you meant to them. And then they did whatever they wanted to you. And now it's like everyone is like, This person's parents are like, Oh, you're a dumbass for doing that. This person's, like, colleagues, friends, coworkers are like, Oh, you're a dumbass for doing that. This person to themselves. Oh, I'm a dumbass for doing that. And this third wheel enemy. Exactly. Look at that. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Someone wants to. F someone. This third. Three cards on each. The third wheel enemy has to come to you and like compromise. Like, hey, I'm sorry, but they don't know what the fuck to do. They're. They. They've. Yeah, they're. They're very reluctant. To taking advice <laughs> they don't they anytime they get advice they're like no I'm not gonna do that why would I no I'm not gonna oh I see, I'm not gonna apologize to collective no I'm not gonna why would I do that and it's like well because maybe you'd feel better you know we you know you have to do it you're the one you're the one that got us all together to do this so you need to apologize to collective well I don't know why can't you all do it because y'all did it with me it's like well it's like someone just wants to say that to cause a stalemate yeah literally I got adventure and aid literally that person's full on projection is well you all did it with me so why can't we all go up there in a group we all did it together so let's go there in a group and apologize no you got the group together you're the dumbass that fucked up everyone's life you have to apologize not only to everyone that was involved but to collective as well no one's gonna hold your hand it's giving like, like even if this person does have someone with them, that will turn you away from this person even more. This person has to suck up and come to you like alone. They can't have anyone else hold their hand. They can't like, and they don't want to do that. So they'd rather just well, if I'm not going to do that at all, then it doesn't matter. Well, enjoy your shitty life then i guess like even either way like it, you're going to have a horrible life after this yeah protest loneliness yeah someone's trying to protest their loneliness someone's trying to get attention someone's getting attention because of how disappointed people someone's calling this person a disappointment did this per someone this person's married to is disappointed about this person as well 
or like someone that this person's in a relationship is disappointed in having like to be with them and I feel like they're trying to split away or they, they either have or they're trying to split away from this person and their whole life is becoming a nightmare yeah someone is some, yeah someone someone is not going to be free someone could actually be going to jail because of this as well Someone really needs to, like, but that's okay. Yeah. Someone needs to just accept that they're bound to death. These friends. Everyone in this alliance. Yeah. Someone just needs to understand that they're bound to death uh, for causing conflict in this house. Someone is going to go homeless. And they don't want to accept that. They don't want to accept. It's like someone has to go into community living, but they don't want to do that either. Um, because their ego. This person's getting all being told a bunch of ideas. No, dude. Someone someone's cursed. Someone's okay. So someone just wants to play victim. They had an so someone's whole thing, they just want to play victim. Which is why they're cursed. Um Time is running out. Time has ran out. They can't catch they have no more time to catch. Yeah, dude, like Someone's cursed with misfortune. Someone's cursed with hate, with malice in their heart for playing victim. So now they're about to be victimized. It, because that was their goal, was to be seen as a victim. To be seen as, oh, woe is me. Like, well, look what happened to me. So now that's going to happen to them. And they don't, it's like they don't want that either. But they asked for that. This that That's their gift. They're, they have a gift of being overloaded. Because they're wearing a mask. That's fucking funny. Someone's gift is being overloaded. Someone, someone's, someone's being given the gift from God himself of being overwhelmed. Because they keep one of pretending like things aren't working. So like, yeah. I did. I just. I literally just heard. So you like collecting souvenirs of your victims, right? So here's your own souvenir for yourself. <laughs> so someone, damn, damn. That's kind of. That's fucked up. That's funny as hell. Yeah. Yeah. Someone may be stalking you online, an online community, because they're frustrated that you continue to gain. And they're stubborn and they're awkward. They feel awkward. They don't know how the fuck you keep gaining and it makes them mad. So they're in your energy. And they're just bitching about it. Wah, wah. Wah, wah, wah. Yeah, you live and you learn. This is the card that wanted to come off the bottom. You live and you learn. So someone's learning that if you want to be a victim, you will be a victim. Um, if you're going to act like you, like you didn't do anything wrong, the universe will show you what you did wrong and if you want to play victim to oh I well it wasn't my fault then the universe is going to make you victim to your own mentality uh this person's very weak will doesn't have very much balance um their masculine is very distorted and their feminine is very distorted like they're just not okay someone wants to be a leader though someone really this person really wants to be a leader of some type or to be seen in like high stature but they, they're not. They, they, I don't think that they ever will. Yeah, me too, spirit. Like, literally. It's like, yawn. I don't know. I don't know. It's like, I, it's, it's giving the energy of this person looked at you and was like, what makes you so special? And then you proved what made you so special. And now everyone's like, so what makes you so special? And this person doesn't have anything that makes them special. They're the same as everyone else. You know, agitated, mad, grumpy, a bitch. Um, and it's like, oh, so you're just one of us? Cool. Nothing special about you. Back into the bottom of the barrel you go. I don't know. Crabs are like, you know. I don't know. Someone's just so weird, bro. Someone's so weird.
again, the projection of, like, someone thinking that you're always talking about them. So here's the thing. This person... If you're talking about, so let's say you're a reader and you're talking, you're picking up on energy about someone. This person's watching your videos and thinking that you're talking about them because they know subconsciously that that's how they are and that's what's going on in their life, but they won't admit it. So they want to project that you're talking shit about them so they can talk shit about you to feel better about themselves, but you're not talking about them at all. You're just describing whatever the divine puts into your head. And if what the divine puts into your head is relating to this person's actions, well, maybe you shouldn't act like that. Maybe that's the divine trying to warn you. And also, for the fucking cross watchers that love to like be in here and like giggle and watch my videos, thank you. Um, your views mean the world to me. Um, with your views, it does monetize me. Um, so thank you so much for watching my content and hating me, fan, which is kind of weird. But uh, you know what can you do? So thank y'all. Um, but please go get help. Like, please go get help. <laughs> like, it, game's over. Uh, go get help. Um, welcome back to Earth. If you want to. Not forcing you. But just saying, you know, therapy would, would take you a little bit further down life than what you're doing now. So. And that's not an insult. Mama, listen, a lot of people go to therapy. A lot of people are struggling mentally and need external help. So don't fucking... Like, come on. Especially, like, listen, because here's the funny part. I know you, I know who's watching me, too. I know you all by name. I get downloads. I know who y'all are. You can be scared of that for the rest of your life. I know, I know your names. I know your first name and your last name. And your face. Don't test me. The divine tells me things. I ask. I get answers. I'm not good. I'm not name dropping anyone though. I have more respect than that. But y'all go get help. Okay? I'm doing just fine. How are y'all doing? But it's just important to like, you know, because people in like that itself, people are like, oh haha, they know who I am. But <laughs> it's like, I have known by someone big. <laughs> Like, you know what I mean? Like, someone's like, oh, I'm known by someone. The reader knows who, who I am. Ooh. Like, I don't know. Someone's in deep regret, though. Everyone involves in deep regret. Doesn't matter if they're on your platform, on my platform, on fucking anyone's platform. They're in deep regret. They've literally busted the bubble in their own hand. They don't know what to do. It's like, it's horrible, bro. Yeah, we have the three of books, the four of books. You're able to move forward, stable, uh, literally with the three books on fire like you're literally on fire like you are you're moving forward swimmingly and we have knowledge can y'all <laughs> oh my goodness bless me excuse me can y'all not blow that in my nose literally the incense will blow over here and get in my nose and then I looked over to it and it's shooting straight up and when the incense is up straight uh, that means the divine your angels are around helping you so Thank y'all so much for being here. And they like tickling me. But we have knowledge. Um, you're very knowledgeable. That's why you're able to move forward. Manipulation. Shame in the... <laughs> in the Ace of Books. Yeah. So someone's manipulation tactics has led them to shame. Uh, their whole life is decaying. As, to, you know, as deep as it has to get. But someone is like... Yeah, someone's manipulations have been brought to light. And the truth is, this person is just jealous that you have something that they don't have, which is a, a brain. I don't want to say it that bad, but you, you think more than how other people think. So, what do people... It's like, you know what people do whenever they're scared of something? They either make fun of it or they try and kill it. Sometimes they do both. Um, and it's like, that's all these people have to do is, oh, haha, ha, you're, you're fucking like mega mind. Like, okay. Oh, you're fucking weird because you, you talk about how the world works. Like, okay. Uh, it's like, uh, it's like, are you, like, are you?
are you gonna like I mean half this shit I'm talking about was taught in school you just had to think a little deeper than that and these people don't do that they think it's a waste of time but yet they do all this mental gymnastics to seem better I don't know it's weird I'm done with that projection not the night the king of torches chaos and the page of torches this keeps coming out like this too wow so a cycle a judgment is here and it has put someone who thought that they knew everything back at the drawing board for not knowing a damn thing is that the same thing these look like the same thing someone has like stumbled across their own chaos because look at this card like the the encryption on the wall kind of looks like that creature <laughs> So someone's almost like they were looking for proof of like the truth of like oh let's see what collective's up to let's see how good collective lives is and they seen how good your life is and it's like uh the night of torches <laughs> yeah literally they're like huh they're like like look at that old man's expression that's literally how they're looking they're like what how to collect like collective change like collectives not going through endings collective went through a rebirth we have death and change it's like how did you like you did that like you you survived i thought you would have been dead by now i thought you would have been gone like maybe if you were in my shoes you know not to be mean but maybe if maybe if you were in my shoes you'd be gone by now but uh, courage noises with the five of pentacles <laughs> yeah someone is fucked up they've locked themselves because all that's gold all this is gold this person's sitting in a fucking gold pile with a tiny flame looking scared as fuck this person was looking all over the place for like their achievements their gold mine in life and you were it the whole time so this person's fucked up everything and they're like the void yeah the world it's a cycle is over this person has they can't come back the moon madness the ten of torches yeah everyone who worked together is getting the fucking oh my god is getting the fucking um painful horrible like ten of torches like burdens <laughs> yeah for what they did to you in the past they they only have the past memories to think of Meanwhile, you're over here daydreaming about where the fuck you're gonna go next. So someone's stuck in like, a... Mama, it's just the movie flushed away. They they got fucking flushed down into the sewer system, and you're nowhere to be found. Like you're not in the sewer system. Oh wow, who are you? The full reverse, the nine of pentacles reverse. Yeah, this person is not successful. Most likely not single, most likely paired with someone who they think is ugly. Uh, not saying appearance-wise, but energetic knowledge, everything, emotionally ugly, spiritually ugly, energetically ugly, um, uh, like, mentally ugly. Just stinky doo-doo trash. Because they wanted to take that leap with that person, um, which is... What they can do, that's their, that's their things to do. There ain't no one judging. The three of beakers and the queen of beakers, yeah. They chose the queen of cups reverse. They thought that was the, the best choice to do was the queen of cups reverse. They settled for less. They argued for their limitations. And mama, they got to keep them too. Um, they said, oh, I'm not, I don't want collective. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't think I'm good enough for that. And God said, okay. Are you sure? They said, yeah. And then now here you are in the Queen of Swords energy. Queen of Swords, Seven of Pentacles. Moving forward, putting an effort. Very smart. Very diligent. Very cutthroaty. Um, cold and bitchy to this person, but, you know, that's what they can think. With the Knight of Books, yeah, and you're moving forward without any issues. I don't know, man. Someone just really wants to get to you so bad. But they, it's like, it's giving the energy of like, so this is literally what's going on. I'm picking it up. This is so funny. They do something to piss you off, right? It doesn't work. So instead of admitting defeat and ceasing operations immediately, which 
would be less weird than what they're doing. They're continuing to do the same thing, acting like it's making them feel better, when it, in actuality it's not doing anything at all for them or for anyone else. And they just are doing it and zoning out and just like that type of energy. Um, because they know that you are the queen of sor queen of books, queen of torches, queen of cups. I mean, queen of swords, uh, queen of wands, going to a king of pinnacles energy. Um, they just know that's where you're heading. So it's like how it's it's almost like well, it's like this person might do this, this person might do that, but they don't know what this person would do, especially when it comes to you because. A little secret power of yours is you're able to make people do things that they normally wouldn't do. Um, that's just Earth Angel material, baby. That's just what we're here to do. So these people are acting fucking bonkers. And they never would act like this normally. But that's because you bring in their demons out. You're, gonna, you're about to bring out this King of Pentacles, demons, and his angels. So you can not fix anyone, but help them understand how they are able to coexist <laughs> yeah desire is here ten of beakers someone really wants to fucking get a ten of, pen of, ten of cups with you but they know that they can't with the page of beakers and the ace of beakers yeah this person literally knows that they can't they anything they, they've tried everything in the books they, it's nothing's working you're moving forward queen of pentacles is out here too with the king of beakers yeah so the king of cups uh king of pinnacles or this king of yeah no that's the same energy for sure because you're an empress energy I mean, it's coming out and this emperor energy is kind of like sneaking away almost with the with the nine of torches yeah and the ace of pinnacles yeah that's a gift though is you you fulfilled your prophecy you made your own fulfilling prophecy of manifesting things and of doing what you need to do it's really like someone doesn't believe someone it's really given like it's <laughs> it's given a lot mama it's given a bit too much but this person almost wants to see it happen it's like i don't believe it until it happens um meanwhile it's actively been happening it, but this person doesn't want to believe it until this person comes into the physical. I don't know why I'm picking this up too, but this per these people or this person, take it as it resonates, maybe trying to do very vague, very, very vague spells on your counterpart that's coming in. They don't know who it is, but they're trying to like do some sort of spell work to stop that from coming in and that's not working either because they don't have any power they're powerless um the eclipse wiped everything clean for them but it's their ego that feels like they're able to do something still which is completely bizarre um i don't know it's really just given mental insanity someone really needs to just like take their fucking medicine <laughs> make it like listen take your medicine please because you're only hurting yourself honey um no one no one needs to act like that no one needs to seem like that I it's just gross what else is there to talk about spirit before we head out what else is there Ooh. The Chariot, the Ace of Pentacles, the Nine of Pentacles, the High Priestess, the Four of Pentacles. Beautiful. You already know what's coming in for you with the Ace of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles. That's the Ten of Pentacles. The Ten of Pentacles is coming towards you. With the Four of Pentacles as well, you're in control. It's like crazy. With the world even here. Like, yeah, with the world and the Four of Cups. Someone's, like, you've completed a cycle. Someone's stuck in the past with the Queen of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles, baby. Let me tell you. Coming into union with the double reverse because you're not bound by these people anymore. They can't do anything. They're not a Cups upright. Happiness. Fulfillment. Wishes being granted. Very just beautiful energy out here for y'all. Yeah, the sun. The King of Swords and the Magician Reverse, yeah. 
You know, you the sun is here to shine on you, to give you vitality, to give you strength. You are the, like the king of swords. The truth is, this these magicians reverse. These people that act like they have some sort of power and control over you don't. And they know it too, but they're just... It's sad, I don't know. It's almost like they're just like, oh, well, if it doesn't work, then I'm going to act like it never happened in the first place, which is even more delusional than anything but that's the that's the path they want to go down just completely fine um it's not your fault um why they wish to go down these weird paths so you don't have time to you know don't listen to them but the four of wands it's being four of swords my, God, my bad um being laid the rest with the ace of cups reversed and the princess of pentacles and the queen of swords yeah the knight of pentacles yeah you being this queen of swords energy still your sword is still up to these people for decent reasons. I can totally see why. Um, just you don't have time for bullshit. You don't have time for liars, for thieves, for Neanderthals. You know, leaving it as it is. Um, they can't... It's like... It's stopping everything that they're doing and they can't really do much about it. Yeah, Nine of Cups comes out in reverse to the Ten of Cups. Yeah, so... <laughs> Yeah, with the three of pentacles. Someone knows that you put in a lot of work into yourself and you deserve this uh, ten of cups. Um, but someone just is very ungrateful and they want to... This princess of wands wants to cause a lot of conflict because you walked away from them. They, they don't know. It's like, yeah, a princess of cups. So someone is just like... Baby. It's giving baby energy. Because someone almost wants to seem like they are you but it's like a mini me it's like a, it's like the doodle bob it's really giving doodle bob energy because someone tries to act like you uh copy your humor wear the same clothes you have uh use the same mannerisms as you that's why they watch you so much but this person deep down is fucking scared because they know if they loosen their grip on someone that someone will come to you and they don't want that to happen and they don't want anyone else coming to you because they don't want people to see you for who how beautiful you are and this person uh the energy of suicide keeps popping up i don't know why maybe does this person want to kill themselves is that like tower comes here so this person's tower moment may be like trying not to kill themselves because of you which sounds fucking bizarre to say like that but that's what's coming up i don't mean to come off so rigid and blunt but that's the energy that's coming up someone really is trying not to show how depressed and how they just want to click off this planet because you're better than them quote unquote because they keep projecting that onto you i go get help <laughs> that's all i have to say like don't like do what you want i'm here to tell you not to do it because i don't support that type of shit as a survivor of those things it's not very fun um go get help um take your medicine and if you really feel that bad about someone doing better than you you should probably stop watching that person you should probably stop being around that person because it's only going to make you feel worse and if you're not going to love yourself enough to separate yourself from things that don't make you feel good you are gonna end up on that path of that right ear ringing as i say that i don't know i feel like that's the last straw for this person i think that that's what the fuck is going on here the star the moon and the fool jesus christ Yeah, it's given like this person doesn't know how you move forward. This person doesn't understand anything. It, like, really, they don't. They they see that you do something, and then it works for you, and then they do it, and it doesn't. They don't get it. So they want to cause conflict to you because you move forward with peace and victory. They want to say that you're doing some sort of spell that they don't know of, or like you're doing something, or you're getting help from unknown sources. This person, like... They don't have the blueprint. They don't have the answer to the Sphinx. If the Sphinx appears to them and tells them the riddle, they don't know the fucking answer. You do. This person doesn't like that you know the answer to the riddle. 
because they keep trying the same riddle in different ways and it's not working. Thoth has prevented, Thoth is literally barricading. It's like, Thoth is really like pl like blocking this person from doing anything. It's like, okay, so you're not learning. Um, you still haven't cracked your own code for who you are. We're just not gonna let you move forward because you need to learn. And this person's like, well, I'm gonna keep trying anyway. And every time I try, it fails. Which is why I feel like the energy of suicide gets coming up because it's just like they're getting so frustrated, the energy is becoming so sporadic. They're becoming, men they're deriving themselves insane. This person already suffers from like some sort of like mental illness. I don't, I'm not a doctor, but I'm feeling it. It's like imposter syndrome. They want you to feel like you have imposter syndrome because they have a personality disorder. They don't know who they are but they categorized you as something else. So they want you to feel like you shouldn't be in that position, which is weird. <laughs> this person needs to play doctor on their own life and not yours. Um, especially with this fucking bizarre ass energy coming out. Three of wands, you get to move forward and they don't think that's fair. Ten of pentacles, yeah. Someone feels like it's an injustice to them that you get the Ten of Pentacles and you get to move forward towards it because they can't. It's real. It's given like this person will literally wear clothes that you wear. Um, I'm just going to draw my energy back as well. I'm going to call all my energy back to me and prevent anyone from having it. But it's the energy. It's it, I'm feeling like because we're about to get into something that I don't want people to um, try and leech from. Um, because we are talking about very specifics at this time, so these people are going to go fucking bonker loco at it. Um, also, while I do that, let me do the, one of these. But it's like, this person will wear the same clothes that you do, talk the same way you do, have the same mannerisms, try and like, it almost is going as far as having the same diet as you, just to understand what you're doing differently from them and everything is failing so they think that because they're so perfect and they're so special that you're doing something that they're not seeing and they can't get to it by stalking so they just want to make you feel like you're not worthy of it yeah, with the Princess of Swords being here, that's exactly what's happening. This is someone that literally does not think they, they 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 wish they were as creative as you. They wish that they had the sparks that you had. They wish that they could do anything that you could. I don't know. It's like someone's a quitter. That's plain point center, someone's a quitter. Someone has given up on everything in their life. They just give up if it's not easy or handed to them on a silver platter. Six of Swords Reverse, I'm not here to lie to you. They're just a quitter. Um, and they looked at you and thought you were a quitter. And you're not a quitter. And now this person's like being driven insane because you're not a quitter. Um... Again, like, this could be a race thing with the tennis. Yeah, this person's fucking done. Like, head in the hand basket, bro. Someone's, like, devastated. They don't know what the fuck to do. They're, it's over for them. Someone really does not know, like, anything. I'm gonna put it blank. This person doesn't know a damn thing. They don't know what they're doing. They don't know how they're doing it. They don't know what the fuck. And they want to make they want you to feel like that too. They're like, oh, I don't I don't know what's happening in my life, so why should collective? But you know what's going on in your life. Because it's your life. And they don't under they don't understand that. They they don't have boundaries for one. I'll leave it at that. They feel like if they're in anyone's energy, they have the right to it, which they don't. Um and they get pissed off whenever people don't allow them to have their way. I don't know. This person just has a lot of fucking childhood issues, relationship issues, control issues. And you name it, they got it. Fucking. 
it's like, oh my god, like, oh, you gotta go walk the dog, go take care of the dog. Oh, I don't want to. Well, why'd you buy the dog? Because I wanted a dog. Well, why aren't you taking care of it? Uh, because I'm gonna tell myself when to take care of the dog, not you. It's the energy system. It's like, it's just stupid. Like, someone is literally like an animal neglector, um, just to seem like they have some sort of power, which is really fucking gross. Someone will, like, ignore their pet uh, that they so here's it's like it's giving the energy of like I don't even like this animal that I have but it's my pet and if anyone says it's their pet I'm gonna scream and say it's my pet um, but I'll I'll scare and abuse this person so much that if they even dare say that this animal isn't my animal um, that they'll know what I'll do and they don't want to embarrass themselves because they know I'm a piece of shit and that I'll do that so um, it's my animal until it's not like I don't know someone just does not take care of their animals I don't know why that's coming through but someone like neglects their animals <laughs> someone's like I don't know why this, <laughs> I don't know who this <laughs> I don't know who this is <laughs> why you just came in um but no someone neglects their animals to seem like they have some sort of power I don't, I don't know like it's really pathetic it's really sad someone like if they have a spouse, I mean, I don't know why I'm picking up a spouse, but this person could have, like, a spouse for a relationship, even with throat chakras acting up, so you know we're on something. But this person will, like, they'll throw, it's like they have an escape route. They'll have someone that they go to to escape to if something doesn't go their way. And they, like, if, if their boyfriend or girlfriend or spouse or whoever calls them out, on something, they'll throw a hissy fit and book it somewhere else. Book it to this other person. And then if this person does something to piss that person off, they'll book back to the other person. They, they're... They're just a leech. They're a bum. Like, shit. I ain't got... Like, they're a bum. They, they're, an, they're an energetic bum. They have no use in anyone's life other than just to be a nuisance. I'm just like, that's just the truth. I gotta get it out. Like, there is there is no fun. This, like, even if this person's having fun, no one else is gonna have actual fun. Because this person doesn't know how to have actual fun. Um, Not with the higher thing coming out, too. God, God's saying, God's like, yep. Thank you, God. Thank you, Spirit, for coming through. It's a tower reverse, yeah. Anyway, this person almost wants to knock you down to size chariot reverse because they... <laughs> Someone wants to knock you down to size because they've been knocked down to size. And it's like... It's like an ant. It's like an ant is coming up to you and like climbing on your leg and you just flick it off. And then the ant comes back to walk back on your leg, and then you flick it off again. That's what the energy's given. That's what this person feels like. It's just like something so small and insignificant that you just like flick it, it goes away. And then oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna march my little tail back over there, and it's gonna take me like five minutes, but I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> and then they do it, and then you flick them away again. And then I don't know, they come back with another ant, they come back with two ants. I don't know how the fuck you know colonies are like that. But the Emperor reverse that should say enough the the tower reverse the chariot reverse the emperor reverse this person can't come forward it's giving like it's like they knocked down some sort of tower but it's like yeah i've healed from it but they switched all their healing underneath the bed and god goes huh really you mean all this stuff and it pushes the rubble back in front of them so now they like yeah they broke the tower down there's no tower but now there's a bunch of rubble that they're gonna have to hand pick up look at and then put somewhere else and this person doesn't want to do that either so they can't move forward ten of pentacles reverse yeah queen of swords reverse queen oh my god look oh my god this is beautiful the king and queen of swords reverse the knight of cups reverse and the ace of cups reverse yeah i don't that's not the adams family because even the adams family is took together this is the karmic relationship, yay! The two fucking liar narcissists that don't actually have any love for each other are stuck together, and that's justice. Wow! Put the two, I mean shit, the two of cups reverse as well, damn. Ain't that cute. You know what? You know what? 
at least you know, good job. You got you have a karmic relationship. Are you ha like at least you're able to fake happiness together? If that's what you want, barely that it is because it's coming out. So, congratulations on your fake marriage and your fake relationship. Um. And your fake anniversaries, like I'm just gonna put it out there because it's real. Um, I don't know. It's given the energy of like everyone has to have a relationship. Oh, you're how old and you don't have a you don't have a lover yet, and you're this old. Oh, I'm gonna get a lover before you then to make you feel even more insignificant. But there's no actual love. Why, like, why do you think there's so many false marriages and fake relationships going on where everyone's fucking and cheating on each other? Because y'all never loved each other in the first place. Y'all just clicked together to make someone jealous or you were so hoggish and overwhelming and meh that you wanted someone else to get, like, you just, like, y'all got issues. Don't be jumping into relationships, y'all. I thought we were smarter than that. I thought we were smarter to actually envelop like real love instead of like yeah I'm just gonna have someone so I don't so I'm not alone or that I don't have to do X Y Z yeah I don't know these people are trying to hide that too <laughs> yeah temperance as well your balance mama I don't know yeah someone's scared about that someone's scared that they're not gonna be able to move forward it's even like yeah I have the fake relationship I have the right to you know fuck whoever I want but I'm still not going anywhere in life. It's like, dog, brother, sister, get up. Stand up for yourself, dude. Ain't no, listen, why do you think people have low respect for you? Why do you think everyone talks down to you or, like, ignores you, dog? Like, you ain't got no respect on the streets. <laughs> I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna, uh, but, I don't know, bro. Someone, someone, they got lessons on top of lessons. On top of lessons, on top of lessons, before they even get a breadcrumb of a blessing. Meanwhile, you've learned your lessons and you're getting your blessings. And now it's like, these people, like, they don't even see the lessons you're learning anymore. They don't even understand what you're still learning, but you're still getting your blessings. And it's like, there's no way. How are you still getting? You're not learning anything. It's giving, like, dumb shit. And they want, to, they want you to give to them because... Oh, well, you learned that love is unconditional. So, love me unconditionally. And you're like, I am. Actually, I am from afar. Uh, you see, um, you have, I guess you haven't got to that level yet where you learn how to love from afar without being mean, but apparently you have it. So it's so weird, dude. Someone's like, oh yeah, if you're such a good person, then give me something. I'll give you my answer, which is no. You said something. So I'll tell you what my answer is. It's no. Going back to the energy of like, can I please have the red, uh, can I please have the red marker? And she goes, no, you cannot. That's literally the energy. It's like, it's like, okay, so can I have like your energy, your attention? Can I have your money? No. What the fuck do you mean I can't? <laughs> like, I, well, you asked me. It took you this long to ask. So of course I'm going to tell you no. You did a bunch. You did a bunch of bullshit. You maybe had a you you <laughs> like you had to go back to elementary school to learn how to do this shit, and now you feel like you deserve it. No, you can get humbled. Get humbled first. Stay humble. Always stay humble. It's these people don't like being humbled. It, that's their that's their that's the ketamine. Not ketamine. It's a kryptonite. Someone might be on ketamine, bro. Someone just has... I don't know who this is in my energy. Why do y'all do ketamine? Get, stop. Like, get get out of my energy. I'm tired of talking about ketamine. I'm so tired of it. Like, that's all y'all do. <laughs> that's all y'all do. Out in these streets. Goodness. Oh, the high priestess reverse and the forest are reverse, honey. Yeah. There ain't no rest for the wicked. And money does not grow on trees. I mean, it... It's cotton, so of course it doesn't grow in trees, but it's energy, so, you know, but anywho, someone's not smart, but <laughs> this came out twice. Someone just doesn't know what the fuck. Someone did not, someone stuck in between realms. Someone wanted you stuck between knowing and unknowing, and now this person stuck in between knowing and unknowing, and 
the, their brain is like turning into mush. That's probably why they're on ketamine. <laughs> not trying to be mean. <laughs> I'm really not, but I can't. Ah, shit, yeah, they're stuck thinking about the past. They don't have, like, yeah, they're stuck thinking about all the things that they did. <laughs> why is that song playing? I don't know why. There is an image I have on my phone of, like, a, a tiny baby monkey wearing pants doing, like, this. <laughs> and in the impact font, it goes, all the things he said, all the things she said are running through my head, running through my head. And that image is, like, very prevalent in my mind right now. And I love it. Someone is thinking about everything you said and how it was right and how it is right this could literally be you saying something like present moment right now and this person hearing it and them going huh yeah you know you're right but fuck you anyway <laughs> like like bros are crazy oh my god this energy is so funny i don't know that's what's coming through though it's like they <laughs> <laughs> They're like, oh yeah, like I'm a little teapot type energy. Like, fuck you. <laughs> Here by Steam. Tennis World Reverse. I don't know what the hell, man. Tennis World Reverse. She ain't got nothing to worry about, baby. You're fine. Temperance as well with the lovers. And the Five of Wands Reverse. And the King of Cups. Oh, baby. Yeah, there's no con. <laughs> this King of Cups is like so. Maybe there's someone in your energy that's trying to cause competition. There's like comp there is competition, but you're not involved in it. I feel like this competition is like between men or between women who are fighting over a, a, a you, you know, like well, take it as it resonates. But these people are like fucking delusional because like it's giving like while all this fighting is going on, there's someone just creeping around like the corner. Hey. That's how they're like, hi, how are you? And then you two are going to like click up and be cool. But there's so much fighting and chaos between these people. It's like, I'm going to get the, I'm going to get the Earth Angel first and you're not going to get them. And then someone else is like, no, I'm going to get the Earth Angel and uh, you're not going to get them actually. But your Wheel of Fortune's here and you're, it's actively, it's actively been unblocked by you. I shit you not. Yeah, this King of Wands, Seven of Pentacles, the Star, the Two of Wands Reverse, and the, the, the Wheel of Fortune, like you your path is unblocked like you're someone doesn't know how they're gonna come towards you someone doesn't know who or how but it's coming someone doesn't like that your path is unblocked someone doesn't know it's like can you at least manifest for me before you go no stay stuck no progress for you the world reverse stay where you're at please put a muzzle on quit barking you got rabies or something, honey. I don't know, bro, but people are crazy. People are crazy. And they're only doing it for attention. It's not like these people actually want your love. They just want your attention. They just want your energy. They just want your money. And your, your, your fucking... Whatever the hell is. They don't care. So... You're giving them that energy of not caring. And then it's like, oh, you can't ah, you can't do that. You're supposed to care. Where's your love and light now? Is the energy like you don't you're not operating out of love and light. You're you're operating out of, of give of making me feel lackful, which isn't love or light. It's like, okay. Sorry, you feel that way. <laughs> I ain't trying to project that type of energy out either by saying it's all woe is you, but mama, you act on like you are woe, so, you know, woe is you, and get your fucking baba back in your mouth, just something, I don't know, like, I'm, again, I'm not trying to be mean, but these people are just crazy as fuck, I'm gonna draw one from the bottom, I think that's the energy that we need to get out, because I literally flipped it open and like a, a bajillion cards came out, not a bajillion, goodness gracious, I'm Okay, y'all. No, 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 no. We're not doing this for every card in the deck's gonna slip out again. No. So, first we have Dragonfly, which is adaptability. The Dragonfly is the symbol of light and change. It is a reminding you to bring a bit more lightness and joy into your life in order. Okay, y'all gotta quit falling out because I'm not. Y'all slip around too much. 
in order to bring uh it is reminding you to bring a bit more lightness and joy into your life in order to bring about the changes needed to reach your full potential approach things lightly i mean shit mama please this snake which is transformation you will be shedding old skin and emotions and transforming them into something bigger and better. Change is in the wind, and you are at the center of it all as the catalyst. To smoothen the process, make sure that your intentions are clear and that you will and that you move forward with hope. Always. We have Bobcat, which is mystery. The Bobcat teaches you that there are, there is true power and strength in silence and patience. In order to get what you want, you must be willing to plan, adapt, and above all, have the patience to see your dreams manifest. Oh, period. We love the bobcat. That's the first time we got that. We have deer with gentleness. This is a reminder to be gent more gentle with yourself and others. The grace, sensitivity, and gentleness of this spirit animal echo through the qualities brought forth from uh, brought forth when loving when living from the heart. Goodness. And last but not least, we have Wolf with his inner strength. You may be facing a challenge you feel less than prepared for. This is a reminder that you have all the tools in your spiritual treasure chest to handle this effectively. Take a step back and try and take a look at it with fresh eyes. Ooh. Okay, Wolf, come through. I don't know why Star Fox 64 like quotes started just playing in my head, and I can't even name one of them out. The only one I could name is do a barrel roll off the top. Like literally, that's the only one that's like repeating now. <laughs> but I got like I got Wolf from fucking Star Fox 64 like just popped up in my head after that for some reason. I'm gonna get you your angel cards, and then we're gonna go into the T deck. Um, yeah. I just heard Yippee. so yeah something's happening uh unconditional love with the with divine mother thank you divine mother for helping me to give and receive the love i desire and trust your vibes thank you angels today i choose to trust my intuition and your guidance spiritual support dear angels i allow you to support me as i grow to become more spiritually aware um don't hate meditate thank you angels for guiding me to love through meditation open your heart with archangel chamuel thank you chamuel for removing the barriers around my heart oops trustworthy friends uh thank you angels for surrounding me with people i can trust and love spirit animal thank you animal kingdom for blessing my path with love and last but not least, lost. Last but not least, uh, inner power with the Divine Father. Divine Father, thank you for co-creating my world with me. We have both the Divine Mother. We begin with the Divine Mother. We end with the Divine Father. That's fucking beautiful. Um, y'all, yeah. that's beautiful. That's amazing. I wanted to say that's maze balls. Who the hell out there says that? I know that's one of y'all. Who says that? Tell me. I ain't judging. I just want to know. That's funny as fuck. <laughs> um, it, don't you tell me you're a water sign. Because water sign was the only card on the bottom. Is it a water sign that says that? Is you a water sign? I bet you a cancer. <laughs> I ain't trying to judge. I ain't being mean. But I think this shit's funny. Shuffle three more times. But yeah, I hope we're all doing well and feeling good, feeling happy. I feel called to shuffle like two more times. I don't know why. <laughs> okay. But yeah, I hope you guys are feeling good and being blessed and feeling loved and all sorts of fun things because you deserve it.
Oh my lord. I'm getting so many messages. Like, just watching these cards fall out. Okay. I was just about to say. I was hearing so many fucking, like, messages coming through. And... Someone's a Debbie Downer because you released them on the bottom of the card. That's what I got. But I just kept hearing shit. Um, it was like a lot, and I think it all came out. But we have Scorpio. It was an energy vampire. Ah! Uh, <laughs> not the... But here, you got money on the way. 888, you got money. Abundance on coming from the way. You're not having a fall from grace. You are a chosen one. Pisces. Get you some sigils, honey. This moon magic is going back on people. You're not envious of anyone. Why would you be envious of someone tearing apart their life? Why would you be envious of someone that doesn't love themselves? That's weird. That's weird. Uh, these people are not of the love and light. These people have a lot of karmic energy on them. Uh, higher heart chakra is misaligned. They have no soul. Oh, God. Yeah, they have a distorted view. Uh, the evil eyes are being blocked. You don't... You're not being backstabbed anymore. You're the star, which is why you make monies. You don't operate out of lust, so you're fine. Like, Jesus Christ. We have envy, lust. Jesus Christ. Spirit is here on these fucking narcissists uh, because you love yourself. They're trying to hold on for dear life because they're fake. And the grass was greener because it was fake. That's hilarious. It always is. Job or workplace, they could be watching you there. Your job and earth plate, workplace could be getting an upgrade. They gotta let you go because they're not earth angels or they're not an earth angel. You can relax. They wanna be you, a Sagittarius. They can't, you, they don't know how to sage, so they can't, their sage is not helping them out because karma. Yeah, they've been set up. They got set up. A karmic mask got set up for being petty and jealous and envious. Okay. Your light solar plexus chakra, you're on your life path. Aquarius could be giving you a trauma response, or Aquarius, be careful of trauma responses. Uh, no more fake friends. You're safe from any energy vampire that comes across. There's a fucking rat in your energy with pee. Yeah, they're making a wrong turn. Scorpio, damn. There's just a weirdo in your energy that wants to take advantage of you. Because you're a great healer and you're not healing them, 44. Uh, you love yourself too much. This dream thief can't do anything to you because you got the green light. And they did not dodge some sort of bullage. Oh. Um, yeah, these fake friends. There's a lot of fake friends coming out. You have a true love. Your true love may know Reiki. Ooh. Um, return to Cinder. Everything. Um, LOL. You are protected by the most high. Um... What you can also do instead of return to senders is you can just keep their energy since they want to send it to you and transmit it all to love and light. If you can do that, I recommend doing that because if they're gonna give you your energy, if they're gonna give you their energy, you can just use it for yourself. Like there's no there's no shame in transmuting it to love and light. You know, if they're gonna if they're gonna attack you, you can defend yourself by doing that. Stay in the flow of things, though. Gemini, yeah, Jesus Christ. The Gemini might want to fight you, oh God, because they're losing money and their sleep magic isn't working. Their entity attachments are going back to them. They want your forgiveness because you don't have soul ties with them anymore. Um, that's awkward. That's what I said. That's awkward. Oh my God. It is so awkward. Can you can you forgive me? We don't have soul ties anymore, so can you like forgive me? Like you've already forgiven them. I don't know what the fuck they want. Maybe this is someone you haven't forgiven. Maybe this is someone that feels like you haven't forgiven them, but that's not your problem. But anyway, I love you all to the moon and back tenfold in forever. That's your reading. Um, hope you've enjoyed it, Mama. I love reading for y'all. Uh, again, thank you all for the support on the moon goodness on the meditation music i hope you all enjoy it if you want to request your own custom hit me up readings hit me up whatever you need hit me up um i'm here to help um i don't have much time in my day to like actually like respond to everyone's emails or to like have personal like one-on-one -on -one talks um so if you want to have like 
contact with me the best way to doing it is by uh, doing the google group thing um because i'm i'm more active in there than honestly anywhere else um but i love each and every one of you all to the moon and back tenfold and forever and i will see you all later